Prodigal Steve returns to the Darkest Dungeon. Hello, everybody. We're back. Darkest Dungeon, week two. We're going to sort out who's getting committed, if anybody, and embark on our second mission. I know last week's, or the last week in the game, was a little bit shorter of an episode, but those will get longer as the series moves forward, once we move away from the short missions and into medium and long. Um, I don't really want to do more than one week per video, and then, because when once we get to long missions, I'm not going to just run, like, I'm not going to run two long missions in one video. That'll be way too long. So I want to set the precedent now of one in-game week per video, and we'll just have to push through these short videos a little bit here to begin with. That being said, let's get into it. All right. So I was thinking about doing this mission. Medium, level 1, 100% of room battles for an uncommon antiquarian trinket. And I was thinking to myself, that sounds like a really good trinket, plus 25% max HP. For a class that I'm told is super broken. But then I'm like, most of our, like over half of our party is pretty stressed so do i want our second mission to be a medium mission to clear 100 percent of room battles to gain a trinket for a class we don't have and i think the answer to that is no so i'm gonna look at these two short missions and i think this is the one that we're gonna do all of these are for trinkets for classes we don't have yet but I love the grave robber as soon as we get one we're just gonna go buck wild with them they're they're so good um, I've never had a grave robber I think that I haven't that hasn't just been great for me so I think we're gonna try and get this trinket get some portraits as well and it's just exploration so we can sort of pick our route a little bit better that being said, I don't know who we're going to take with us. I want to bring our leper for sure. All right, he should be in the first two slots. So let's put you here. We might bring our second... or our second uh, highwayman get him leveled up hmm. and I don't know what else we're going to do here because basically these three have to be in the first two slots. Oh, maybe I guess not. Okay, you know what? Here's what we're going to do. You can be here. You can lead the party. You can slot in here. And then number f four can be... Our plague doctor, I guess. Then you can't get committed this week because you'll only pray and the caretaker is praying. But these two can. You can't gamble. But you can go here. A little hope. However desperate is never without worth. And then you can come here. All manner of diversion and dalliance await those who cross. 
cross the threshold and with that'll be that all right let's provision and head out all right we'll take a shovel and a key and eight food and, you know let's just do eight torches why not okay that should be sufficient Into the ruins we go. Take a sip of my coffee here real quick. And we're ready to go. Face out the halls of your lineage once familiar. Now, hmm. foreign. Well, I like the scouting. But man, that puts us in a weird spot. So we could probably only skip one of these rooms. So here's what I'm thinking. Here, 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 here. Backtrack, then up and around. All right, you can go ahead and salvage a torch for us. We will also be disarming this trap that's coming up because I expect that you have the greatest disarm chance. This is correct. All righty. A torch Master and head in. I haven't lifted, used lepers all that much. Clear. Okay. We'll keep going this way. Get ready to disarm this trap. Oh, jeez. Cruel machinations bring to life. That could have gone better. Purpose. Hey. Got a portrait as well. This is uh this is exciting. Good job, team. And the scouting just keeps on coming. This is beautiful. Okay, so we're gonna have two battles right in a row. But that's okay. Crack this open. Five hundred gold. Is only the first test. Shovel. We might be doing more backtracking than I would like, unless we find another shovel. I don't really want... I mean, this is super eventful so far. Okay, let's move to this room. Hopefully disarm this trap. Then we'll we'll roll back around and actually get into some combat. And it'll it'll be coming pretty quickly. Okay. What do I do with this thing? Holy water, maybe? Item had no effect. Okay. Alright, I'm just gonna walk away from that right now. Maybe a key will do it, but I wanna use the key to get some treasure. Okay. And now we head back. Hopefully we don't hit a, a surprise battle on the way, but honestly some combat would be fairly welcome at this point. Alright, burn a torch. Head towards this room. Crack into this backpack. It's already been looted, huh? Well, this is unfortunate, but not super surprising. Okay. Oh man, and what a first battle we have. Yeah, a lot of stress damage coming. So we want these two to get taken care of as soon as possible. All right. Let's see. The madman, I think, is worse. So we'll go ahead and pistol shot. Oh. Not what I was looking for. Alright. I'm not super familiar with the leper's skills, so it might take me a minute to sort out what I want to do here. Do I want to do a potentially lethal attack? I mean, it's a real low chance of being lethal. Or do I want what's this? 
2 to 4. Minus 20% damage and minus 5 accuracy. Alright, I think we hew these guys. That's, that's pretty much what I expected would happen. Okay. So, we'll go ahead and play grenade these guys. Hopefully, we can get some light. Get a little damage over time. Not going well so far. I mean, we're not in a bad position. Don't let me oversell the situation here. Alright, you can zealously accuse these two, and then a hue should take care of both of them next round. I really wish you wouldn't do that. That's good. I like the dodge. I like the dodge. We are going to use Battlefield Medicine and uh, cure the bleed on our leper. Now we will zealously accuse these two. Almost got the kill there. Alright. I'm going to try and pistol shot this guy. Beautiful. The crit and the stress heal. And now we'll heal. Love it. All right. Now we just need to get rid of this guy. So let's do that. Stun him. Now hopefully we can destroy him before his next turn. That asking you shall receive. And we got another shovel, even better. And we got a highwayman trinket. Plus 10% damage for range skills, minus 20% stun resist. That seems okay, honestly. So we're going to go ahead and... Oop. Can I can I not equip you? Okay, there we go. Alright, how is everybody doing health-wise? It looks like we're doing alright, honestly. So, I'm going to walk forward a little bit burn a torch, and then head in. And this is a battle that I'm much less concerned about. This guy's annoying, and this guy's annoying. But they're not unmanageable. We'll try for the Blight here. 10% resist and 10% resist. Like it. And double Blight. Beautiful. Okay. Four damage, so I need to do five to get him into lethal. So if we hit, we're guaranteed he will be dead before his next turn. There's no way he's going to die before he does damage unless somebody else moves before him. But even then, nobody is ranged, so it's not going to matter. All right. Let's just get this guy into lethal range, and we'll, we'll sort out the Arbalist in a second. These two guys in the front shouldn't be too big of a problem. Big dodge. Okay, I, uh... Do I want to zealously accuse these two? Or do I just want to try and, you know... Smite and then chop? 6 to 12, 85%. Uh, let's try that. Yeah, pretty much figured. Okay. You has a chance to kill this front guy and is guaranteed to kill the back one. So... Okay, well... Pretty much what I expected. Alright, we'll pistol shot you, and that should put you in lethal range of the Blight. No, not quite yet. So, we can use... Another Plague Grenade, I guess? And that'll definitely put you in... Oh, yeah. You're super dead now. Great yep. Is the weapon that cuts on its own. And we'll just chop this guy up and sort that out. See? Easy. The stress is pretty real, though. 
that's nice. Two onyx. Okay, so we just need to do two more rooms. So it's going to be those two. Well, how are we doing on torches? We have four? Alright, we're just going to crack into this. I know I should snuff the torch, but honestly, this is fine. We don't need to min-max quite this hard yet. Alright, and we do have a second shovel. I'm starting to think that it's best to just bring two shovels always. We don't need to do the torch just yet. Move to this room. Once we do, we'll uh, we'll burn a torch right before we leave and get ready for this next combat. I mean, I know I'm complaining about the stress and then I leave the torch low, but we'll be okay. All right, here we go. Ah, and it's an easy one. Just got. Two of these bone rabbles and an arbalus to deal with. Not a problem. Five damage on the pistol shot. Uh, it's really hoping close to the nine range, but five is fine. We'll go ahead and... Yeah, I think we'll go ahead and throw out a blade grenade. His heal isn't going to do a whole lot since nobody's blighted or bleeding. All right, so he just needs five damage done to him, and he will be dead before his next turn. So we're going to go ahead and battle heal yourself, actually. Oh, I love the crit. That's beautiful. Now you can heal these guys. And big miss. Not a huge fan of that. Okay, um... Well, I guess we'll just blight this dude again. He has 8 HP and... Okay, so that was not exactly what I needed. Alright. Well, pistol shot will do it, though. The slow there it is. Alright. This isn't so bad. I think I am overly worried about the early game. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. And then we can just do a battle heal, actually. We might want to have him heal himself if we get that opportunity. Nice. I like the crit. We'll do a pistol shot and sort it out. Take all of that and move on. Check this sack real quick. 250 gold. Beautiful. Alright, so far this is going much better than last week where we had, you know, two people on death's door. Oh, that's bad though. Please, push him back as far as you can. Alright, honestly, this is acceptable. Want to get rid of this dude. Nine damage. Beautiful. I love it. Alright, you... Move backwards. You can hew these guys. Six and eight damage. Let's this is acceptable. All right. We'll sort the bleed out here in a second. You've got to move forwards. Oh, man. That full party stress, though. Yeah, I know my hero is bleeding. I'm going to sort that out right now. There we go. That actually might have been subpar. He might have only had like a one point for one more round left. All right, you're gonna play grenade these two. That's devastating blow. Nice. Okay, you are in lethal range. So let's 
let's see if we can't get you there as well. That'll do it. All right. So those two in the back are no longer an issue. It's just these guys in the front here. So we'll hew. That puts them both pretty close. So a zealous accusation should sort it out. There we go. Do a battlefield medicine here. Take care of that bleed. And there we are. More onyx. I love it. Remind yourself that overconfidence is a slow right. and insidious killer. You can have some food. Alright. Let's check this out. Oh. Of course. I didn't know you were a kleptomaniac as well. And now you're blighted. Ah, you're not your manic for money, I see. Alright, well, I guess we'll use the anti-venom on you. And we'll burn our last couple of torches. And head in here. I want a, I want a chance to surprise any enemies that are in this room. Yeah. Really would have liked a surprise there. Oh, we're going to be doing a lot of stress relief once we get back to the hamlet. Seven damage, acceptable. Go ahead and throw out a plague grenade on these guys in the back, get some light done. What do we want to do here? I think we focus in on this big guy. Honestly, and then I'm not super worried about the bone soldier. Eight damage, that's over half his HP, so a chop should sort this out. Ugh. Or not. It's alright. In theory it worked. Gotta find some way to up your accuracy. Okay. Um, what do we want to do here? Maybe stun this guy? And bring him to the front of the party. Fair enough. So that means we can crit that guy to death. Exactly how I planned it. Then... We should be able to zealously accuse, or not. Well, Hugh should sort them out then. There we go. Done and done. Beautiful. As okay. mount, what do we have here? Resistance. Eldritch Altar. You know, I'm just going to leave that alone. And I think that will be it. I don't really feel like doing that battle because we're all really, really stressed out. So we're just going to go ahead and complete this quest. The great ruins belong to us, and we will find whatever secrets they hold. Alrighty. Everybody's up to resolve level one, and... Dude, you have a lot of obsessions. I like the uh, plus 10% damage to range skills. That's nice. The plume and the pistol. A fitting end to my folly. And a curse upon us all. Okay. So we have access Make to the no blacksmith we will face and the guild now. Threats. Soldiers must be ready. These three have to go for stress relief. The bellows blast once again. The forge stands ready right. to make a Arblist and a hound's master and a plague doctor. I think we'll for sure get the Hound Master. A lawman and his faithful beast. And forged by battle and bloodshed. We'll probably for sure get our arbalist. Shoot, bandage, and pillage. 
the dancing steps of war. I think we can do without the second plague doctor, though. All right. All of you need to get out of here. What do we have here? Seems fine. That seems pretty good. Hmm. All right, we'll sort that out next time. We have enough that we can commit these three and not worry too much about it. All right, so you can do anything. Don't take you to the Warrens. And you can also do anything. You know, let's... Let's send you here. There we go. Now, we can send... You to the cloister. We do not have enough uh, crests. That's fine. And then you can come here and gamble, I guess. Then next time. I don't know. I don't know who we'll send out next time. We will sort that out in the next episode i expect yep all right so that's gonna that's gonna do it for for week two of darkest dungeon if you enjoyed the video consider leaving a like and comment below if you want to see more uh consider subscribing to the channel and i will see you next time